Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel. In this video, we will, what we will try to do is using this callback refs, we can access the Tom HTML element in the parent component also. So previously, what we have did in the parent in the parent ref text input box, we are able to access only the instance of the child component. We are not able to access the HTML element, Tom HTML element, which is present in the child component. Now using this callback ref, we are able to access the Tom HTML element in the child component. Let's try to do it here. So here I am creating parent component. So that is nothing but parent callback ref text input dot js file. Okay, so now here I will be creating export default class parent callback very long name right so text input text input okay that's it so extends component so here i'll be having a constructor so in the constructor so what i will try to do here i'll be having props so in this props what i will try to do is super of props i will call the props to that super now in this one what what let's try to have a render method in this render method return div and in this div i will be having the callback ref text okay so this is the parent component let's say so in this one this is the parent and in the app.js what i can do is instead of calling this one i will call the parent callback okay so this is the url i am calling in the parent callback ref previously what we have we can only access the what we what i can say we can only access the instance of the component right now what i will try to do is here this dot text input i will use the text input here so we need to access the text input present in the child component right so this dot text input is equal to null here what i will try to do is input ref i am sending a props here in this props i will be i am calling math i am creating a method that is nothing but this dot text input is equal to el nothing what i am trying to write is the whatever the code here we have which is present right the same code instead of writing in a separate method i am writing here in this one so now i am sending this only callback function method as a prop so now this callback ref what i can do is so here what i can do instead of calling this input ref, input ref props dot input ref i can call directly here okay so this input ref this props input ref i will be able to call it here okay now we don't have access to this dom html element in this child component now we will be we will be able to get this element in the parent now here if i try to write console dot sorry component did mount so if i try to see console dot log this dot text input this dot text input if i try to see here if i try to execute this one now we got an error now we are getting an error what is the error we are having component did mount in the child if i cannot able to set the focus and value yeah it's true why because in the child component now this html element doesn't have the access for this one why because the ref has been coming from the props that means from the parent so here we, we should not write here why because we don't have access to the html element now the html element present in the child has access for the parent the parent can able to access now if i try to refresh the page see here if we try to see let me refresh, refresh again now if you try to see here see from the parent callback ref you are able to get the child's card dom html element okay so now if you are able to observe from your from the parent we are able to access the child's dom element now if i want to focus and if i want to do in the parent itself i can do so here what i can do the same process this dot text input dot focus i can do so uh, you see you, un you understood right so i am doing it in the parent here not i am i am not doing it in the child so the element which is present in the child i am able to access it from the parent now here this dot text input dot value is equal to so Leela web dev from parent or whatever the data. Okay. 
So now if I try to see the output here, see I am able to get the Leela web dev from the parent. I am able to access the child's input element from the parent. Okay. So using this callback refs, we are able to access like this. Okay. Hope you understood about this one. So what we have did here, so little bit of confusion it will be there. So in the previous refs, what we have did in the previous ref, we are able to access only the component instance. So through this component instance, we are able to call the methods which is present in the child component so that indirectly we are operating the DOM HTML element from the parent. But the parent component is not able to access the HTML which is present in the DOM, which is present in the child component. But using this callback ref, what we have did, we have accessed this input element which is present in the child component through the parent one okay so this is the main difference so we are able to directly access the dom html element instead of this instance of this child component so we are able directly get the dom html element and we are doing whatever the things we want you can apply the things in the html thing okay so this is not that much of recommended way but we uh, i'm showing you that we have an option using this callback refs also okay so this is what this is the uh, this is what about the callback refs in the ReactJS. Okay, if you have any doubts or any suggestions, please post the comments below to this video. And if you like this video, please do support me by subscribing to my channel. Thank you.